We're back with Laura and Dan Dotson having so much fun. Now, do you ever feel guilty about taking stuff out of these storage units? No, we don't take anything out of the storage <laughs> unit. We sell it right where it's at. The way that yeah. we look at it is if, if somebody loses their stuff, it's terrible. And the last thing this industry wants to do is sell somebody's stuff. So yeah. they don't just sell somebody's stuff. They, they make phone calls. They look at their contracts. They do postings, yes. publications. That's, they go through a lot of things to try to uh, swing deals to not sell somebody's that's stuff. That's one thing we do with our company compared to maybe a few other auction companies. We make sure that the buyer that bought it, we let them know, please return the personal items, photographs, birth certificates, mm -hmm. obviously things that are not important to you. You mm -hmm. know, sometimes those things are easily and readily available once they're clearing out the unit and they leave it in the office or they give us a call and go, I've got a box or so we will get a hold of hopefully the person that lost it because it's not that easy believe it or not mm -hmm. they've gone through every measure it's a three-month process it you know that it takes for these items to go up for sale and a lot of people yeah. ask us do we yeah. feel bad or guilty yeah. about selling people stuff and of course we don't want to yeah. sell anybody's stuff no. if, especially if they're right, right. there and, and yeah. but the way that we figure it the good yeah. side is that it's green the ultimate green you know that say right. one unit that was lost might help ten different families gain from that they got the vacuum somebody got a bed and you can or maybe get, get a ladder maybe the guy's yeah, a painter exactly. and he can't afford a hundred twenty five dollar <laughs> ladder but he can afford a twenty dollar yeah. ladder someone else's yeah. treasure that's yeah. right it's fantastic and you know it's not going to landfill right <laughs> and I, you know, do you have tips for somebody who wants to buy a unit I mean, yeah. what, sure. would you, what would you tell them i would them? absolutely check and find out who is your auctioneer in the area put up their storage auctions and see who comes up to the top of the list it's probably american they could just go to american <laughs> auctioneers.com <laughs> couldn't they be absolutely american auctioneers.com yes. or you know storage Treasures.com is another company that we've co-founded. And, and we that, put some training videos uh, yeah, in you're there have tips that have recently people. come out, and there are tips. And, you know, best thing is just to take cash, have a way to get rid of the stuff, take yes. a flashlight, a, a kidney belt in the pickup truck is always a great idea. <laughs> 24 hours to get out of the unit, make sure you have a strong back, and make sure that you absolutely know that that you bought that unit, you can't leave it behind. And, and if it's a if it's a big unit and you're yeah. there at the auction and you think, God, I need a couple of days, ask yeah. the auctioneer, ask yeah. the manager before Absolutely. you bid. And sometimes you can get extra time. And yeah. that's really good advice. Just figure out where you're going to yeah. go with the stuff. I have one other question here yeah. on the show, which is the greatest show. Thank Thank you. You. Everybody is so funny. Do, oh my do, do, the, do the do people write their own jokes or do the? We usually give them alcohol before. <laughs> but, you know, we spread the it's Jack all Daniels. Thing. Organic. Yeah, this is just wow. the, the cast. You know, when, when we were putting this together, Danny and I and doing YouTubes, I knew right away, Daryl and Danny was like Dave and Jared. We knew that those two couldn't stand each other and what would happen at the auctions. We talked about the day. And how did you find day. them? They've been coming to our auctions known, anywhere from 25 years. We've known Dave for 25 years. And We've known Daryl for 17 years. I've known Daryl for 16 Dave years. Yeah. And Jared and Brandy a few years. And I just knew that that right combination was absolutely worth watching. You know, Barry so, is, is like amazing. Yeah. You know, and Barry's the only guy that we didn't uh, have as customer before the show. He's actually you, uh, he's actually Jesse James's really? Jewish godfather. <laughs> <laughs> and you as a lady, yes. you say something at the end of every auction. Yes. And what is that? That's right, folks. Don't forget to pay the lady. <laughs> That's, That's right. right. <laughs> as every way woman, we appreciate yes. that. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank Thanks you. again for being Thank here. You. Ladies, call it out. Pay the lady. <laughs> call, <laughs> the call it out, ladies. <laughs> we'll be right back. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Of course. Yeah. Thank you very much. That was so